Welcome back, everybody. RP here, and we're back in Supermarket Simulator. And thank you so much for letting me steal some of your time. Lots of lots of love on the last video. You guys are amazing. I cannot tell you how much uh, it means to me that you guys are riding with me on this series. And I am so, so happy. I would also like to say that uh, I got a, the comments were like really, really good. You guys are like sim players are like really, really detail uh, people. You know, they pick out all the details in games and stuff. Things that I don't even think about, actually. And it's so awesome to get these types of comments because basically it's like the state of the game. Okay, let's let's address one comment. One comment I got was, so like right now we have this guy right here to do the cash register and we're going to grow. And, uh, you know, it's still early access. You've got customers kind of coming in and I think there's a bug where they're coming in and not being able to find uh, what they're looking for because you haven't actually bought that license. So I think that might have been addressed. I hope it has been. But if you look over here, one of the comments I got was like, okay, like I feel like I might be like stuck as the stock boy right now, right? But if you come right here, it does clearly say more employees are coming soon. And it's saying more employees. So I'm sure they're, they're, they're realizing that you're not going to be able to run this on your own. You're going to have to have stalkers and stuff like that going down the road. All right, so having said that, another comment I got was... Could we see how the loans work? Wally Gamer wants to uh, basically have us take out a loan. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to take out a loan and we're going to do it just like that on the default. We got 15 days uh, to pay it off and that's going to give us a little extra money so that we can go over to the market, go in, go into furniture and I'm going to grab a, another fridge and I'm going to grab another shelf and that's probably going to take up most of that loan. So let's go ahead and grab that. Then the next thing I want to do is with that loan money, let's go over here to licenses. And we have another license we can get. We've got $1,500. So let's go ahead and just spend $400 and grab this license so that we can add peanut butter, flour, olive oil, uh, et cetera. All right. So with that done, let's go ahead and install these items real quick. So yeah, this is the weekend. I am uh, definitely going to get as much done as I can with these next few episodes to see, you know, what what we can get done with the game in its current state. Uh, you know, we're going to have to be a little bit forgiving. Like I said, we're still an early access title, and there are a lot of things that are yet to be implemented in the game. I like that. That looks good. All right. Awesome. All right. We also, I do have, I want to do, you know, everything that we can do. So let's Let's shut this down. I want to go to management again. I want to go to, oh no, that would be in furniture. Hold on. Got to, got to try to remember where everything is. Market, furniture, lights. I think I want to add two lights because I think we have a spot now for them because we opened up the store a little bit. So I want to kind of keep up with the lighting as well. I don't want to have dark spots in the store. So we'll do this and see how this works. So how does this work? Oh, we have to put them by hand. So there's not like a assigned spot for them. We actually have to line it up. Uh, I actually wish there was like a dedicated spot for it. So we'll just put it right there. Do the best we can. It would be nice if it was, you know, like here's where it goes. This, this blueprint right here, you just fill it in. Because I know I'm going to get these messed up one way or the other. They're not. They're probably not going to be even. Well, all right. Not too bad. Not too bad. I can live with it. Next thing we should do is check out the products. We have new products. Let's go ahead and add peanut butter. We have new flour. Let's add that. We have olive oil. We have salt and rice and another pasta. We'll get one of each and we'll just go from there and see how that works. So I hope you all are having a great weekend. This is the weekend. I'm recording this on the weekend. This is, I think this is the last weekend of February, actually. All right. Oh, we do have to get the other pasta as well. We'll put this pasta up here. I am out of uh, that one pasta. So let's go ahead and put these new products up here. And then I want to just see how the customers come in and what the uh, depletion rate is going to be. I'm going to obviously have to play, you know, super stock boy here and try to keep everything topped off so that we you know make as much as we can 
But this game has, I think the game has a lot of potential and I really want to uh, give it a fair shot. And, you know, I understand some of the comments that people had made, like it can get repetitive. Uh, like I said, if they implement a full employee system, now what is that? That's flower. All right. That's the new flower. Wanted to kind of keep that over here with the other flower, but that's all right. We'll put the peanut butter down here. And now that I have a cashier, I don't have to uh, round our prices. Uh, we can just go ahead and set market price. We don't have to worry about it any longer because, you know, we don't have to make the change anymore. So we'll go ahead and do that. All right, those are priced. What else did we put up here? We put up this new spaghetti. That priced up. Get this rice priced up. All right, $6.91. I've already gone ahead and checked all of these prices to make sure that they're uh, good to go, and they are. And, uh, okay, we need one more thing. We need our pasta. The pasta in the red right here. The just plain old pasta, they call this. Grab two of those. Open up the store. And, uh, yeah, we'll let a day go by and see what's up. See how it works. So, I still think, uh, I still think the game has got a lot of development left to do in it. And I'm going to, like I said, be very forgiving of that and be, you know, aware that there might be things that are happening in the game that shouldn't be happening in the game. There might not be a, a proper balance of customers coming in and wiping you out. We'll see. We will see. Let's get it on here. Too bad we can't name our employee. I'd like to be able to name this guy. You know, I would name him Jack. <laughs> I think I'll just call you Jack. All right. You are now Jack. All right. Here they come. Let's see. Uh, let's see how the AI behaves. What kind of purchasing do they do? Because I guess there can be a, a an opportunity where like some kind of bug where they'll come in and just wipe you out. I mean, literally wipe out one whole product in one full swoop. All right, we're missing the oil. Let's go ahead and get in here. Now, I, I'm i missing oil, huh? I thought I put the oil up there. Olive oil, right? Oh, this oil. Yeah, I got this oil. All right, let's grab two of these. Did I buy that? I did not buy that. There we go. All right. Made a mistake. All right, let's get this priced up. 621. There we go. All right, so that should be everything, right? Let me check my uh, computer real quick here. Make sure I have all my stock. Cheese, the tea. Yeah, I think we're good to go now. I'm going to go ahead and... Just kind of get a head of the game here, and just in case these items do perform, and they probably will, we'll go ahead and we'll get an extra order of that in. Also, on the loan, just so you guys know, you do have to uh, pay it on time, and there are penalties for late payments. So we have to make sure at the end of the day uh, we give our loan payment. I don't, I don't believe it's going to be automatic. I think we're going to have to uh, actually pay it off at the end of the day. So we'll have to pay attention to that, make sure we don't forget things like that so we don't get whacked with uh, late payment fees on the loan. And this was a $750 loan, which we, you know, just basically used to add a new double fridge, another shelving unit here. And it does look like this stuff is starting to move rather quickly. So let's get this stock in here. Let's make sure we keep an eye on everything. The spaghetti, yep, the spaghetti's already going up here. Yeah, I think my next goal is I'd like to try to get storage and uh, see what that's all about, uh, how storage works. I'm not sure how that works, but maybe we can make enough money today in this episode that we can unlock storage. I believe if we go over to storage, let's go to management here storage they've dropped the price wasn't it six thousand before something like that i thought i thought this was six thousand uh, but we can purchase it at one thousand so we'll uh i'm gonna keep the market open in case i have to come over here all right now i have adjusted prices so i am 
priced properly on all of these prices here. I did that before hitting the record button, so we are priced correctly for the day. Wow, what did we run out of already? Holy cow. All right, was it this? I think it is. It's this flower. Hold on. Is it that? Yep, it was that flower. One of the things I wish that we could do is after an item disappears from the uh, shelf, that the price tag doesn't disappear so that I know uh, what item just got depleted. So I don't have to try to, you know, kind of memorize where everything went. This thing's going fast too. We have it right here. Okay, we're just going to try to keep up with it. Got some stock over here that I can put out if need be. How's this cheese doing over here? All right, milk and eggs are doing fine. Getting ready to go low on this flower right here. I don't have any. Let's go ahead and grab a couple of those flowers real quick. Like I said, I'm going to order two at a time just because it's a $2 minimum for the delivery fee. Let's go ahead and turn our lights on here real quick. Get this flower up here. All right, the day went by pretty quickly. It's already 7 o'clock. All right, there we go. How are the lights looking? Looking pretty good. Not too bad, not too bad. All right, keep an eye on things. Don't want things to uh, deplete. Cereal's doing well. It just ran out there at 7 o'clock. Grab a couple of cereals real quick. Keep an eye on that rice. Looks like that rice is going down real quick. Got rice right here. Yeah, so hopefully they will add the stock boys sooner than later and we can do more of a managing. Uh, that'll be great. All right, got to keep a, keep an eye out on both of these sides right here. All right, you're looking good here. Coffee's okay. Sugar's okay. This pasta right here we're running low on. Do I have any? I got one. Throw that up there real quick. All right, we're at the end of the day here. Be able to check out how this uh, how this works now with paying back our loan and everything. Pop off the cereal here. Yeah, I definitely want to try to get storage in this episode so that we can see what storage is like. Right, they're still coming in. We're at level 11. We're heading to a level... 12 here we're halfway it's moving quick i mean i do not have a lot of time to think i just have a lot of time to watch keep an eye on the shelves here i think we made it through the day without uh having a uh armageddon on uh, product and getting wiped out so all right maybe they've fixed that she might be the last one and if she is we'll uh won't hit the end of day yet i want to go check out the bills and see if we have to pay that now. Go over to our, our, our loan and see if our loan has a payment yet. Right here. Payments. Uh, all right. No payments. All installments are made. So it must be at the end of the day. So let's just stay right here. Let's end the day. All right. We made a profit. That's the most important thing. All right. Cheese and oil are down. This is now 504. Go ahead and make that price change. And we're at 315 on our cheese. And that was it. That was the only thing that I got notified. Let's go over here and let's take a look at our bank. And here we go. Here's our repayment. We got to repay it now. All right. That's one payment down. So you're going to have to do that. All right. The start of every day, you're going to have to go ahead and make sure you, you pay your loan. We've got 14 more payments. Now, we could have, uh, there was a bar there. I probably could have extended it, like cut them payments down to 750 You know, made it a 28-day instead of a 14, or a 30-day instead of a 15, because now we're down to 14. All right, what else should we look at while we're here? Bills. All right, let's go ahead and pay this. Just kind of get in the habit of... Uh, Paying our bills at the start of the day, and then we'll go ahead and uh, take a look at our stock and see where we're at. And do we need any replenishments? And we do, so we'll definitely get some coffee going here before we start our day. I think what I will do is double up on this flour. It seems to do well. I'll keep an eye on that peanut butter, and we'll double up on this spaghetti. It's doing well, because I've got three empty shelves here that we can use. So let's go ahead and do that. Let's, uh, all right, we need flour. We need 
Oh, I can't wait until they have the app <laughs> so we could just use the app to reorder. Uh, you know, sort of like when you're actually in a grocery store and they give you the towels on gun and it allows you to point at the skew and then just, you know, punch in what you need to order to replenish that uh, that item. All right. So we're going to get two of these and we're going to get two of these. Salt's doing well. The tea absolutely does not sell. <laughs> I've got more tea than I need. I can probably go into Boston and dump it in the harbor. All right, have my own little tea party. Okay, uh, what else? Peanut butter, I think, was starting to get low. So we're going to double up on our pasta. We're going to double up on our... Uh, what else are we doubling up on? The flour. Let's go ahead and grab another rice and this pasta, and we'll just start with that. I'll keep up with it, and uh, yeah, we'll get the day going. All right, this rice I'm just going to put over here for now, just so that I have it. And let's see if we can make enough money from today's sales to open up that storage. And that way we can get a peek at what that's all about. That'd be a good idea. All right, we got some peanut butter here. I'm going to keep up with the peanut butter. I'm just going to go ahead and rock, rock two of these peanut butters. And what else? We got the spaghetti. i throw another spaghetti over here. Got this spaghetti. I've got this spaghetti. We'll top it off. Go ahead and put this right here. I want to get this flour. And that should do it. We'll open up the store. Do a quick scan. Make sure we have everything uh, topped off. Milk looking good. Cheese. We're low on cheese. We, we'll have to get some cheese. We'll get cheese and eggs. And one more coffee. Oh, sugar. We're low on sugar. Oh, I've got cheese. All right, never mind. Let's, let's top off the cheese real quick. I'm still going to have to order cheese, but yeah, let's make sure we uh, take a look over here what's going on. That's already done. I already did that. Let's put that back down. How's the bread? I throw a little bread up there. Yeah, getting the day started is going to take a little more time uh, the bigger this store gets. So we're definitely going to need stockers. Definitely. They're going to have to give us stockers. I, I, I believe that. They're, they're, they're not going to not give us stockers. All right. Let me order this real quick. I know it's taking a long time to get this day going. I apologize. But it is what it is. There's a lot more to do now. And sugar. Sugar. I was out of sugar. There we go. All right. And I will go ahead and start the day and go ahead and stock as the day starts. Let's go ahead and get the sugar placed. All right, that's good. Put this one down here. All right, we got the eggs. All right, what else did I get? Did I get the, uh... No, I didn't get the cheese. I gotta get more cheese. I'll, I'll wait. No problem. No problem. All right, where do I want to put the eggs? Put the eggs over here. All right, store's open. Come on in, everybody. Let's see how this goes. I want to get the next level of license, too. What's that going to give us? Let's check that out real quick while we let these guys, uh, you know, do their thing. All right, the next product license is at level 9. That's going to be 550. Oh, that gives us orange juice. Awesome. Sodas, two sodas, an apple juice, uh, a milk six-pack, and a bunch of soda. All right, so that's what that refrigerator that we invested in is going to... That'll handle that. Those items will keep these items going in here. How are we doing here? I see more variety of customers, different uh, outfits, different color combinations. So the devs are definitely working on the game. And this is one of the reasons why I like the game is uh, the development team is, is active. I don't know if it's one developer or if it's a team of developers, but uh, they seem to be getting things done. I could stand on my boxes and get a higher view so we can really check out what's going on with the cash register here. You know, watch Jack do his thing. You know, pops those items right in the bag, which is awesome. All right, I'm going to keep our eye on things. Now, we addressed all of our prices, right? I'm just going to go ahead, and while they're buying, I'm just going to show you guys that we are at the right price for all of our items we do not have any price issues everything is priced correctly and i think we're running out of this oil do i have any more yeah i do right here let's go ahead and throw this up here all right what was it what was on the top here see again it would be nice to have the tag kind of stay there 
uh, so that I could get an idea of what they just took. What did I have at the top? I honest to God cannot remember. I didn't have double oils up there, did I? I don't think I did. All right, we're missing something. What are we missing? We got the sugar here. We got the flour. We got this different type of oil here. Did I have anything on the top there? I can't even remember now. All right, let's go over here and check. I wish, like I said, I wish there was a way for us to be able to find out at a glance what you're low on. Even so, even something on the uh, interface, you know, on the front of us here. So it would have been a new, oh, salt. Is that what it is? That's what it is. It's salt. I have salt, right? Oh, right there is salt. Right here. That's what it was. Make sure the price on the salt is correct. 217, 217 it is. Yeah, you see what I mean? I mean, with so many items, like I'm trying to keep track of everything, right? All right, so that rice is going down. Did I buy extra rice? I did. Uh, again, see, like just right here, noticing this, I've got to make sure, you know, so your bet, my best, my best bet is to catch it before it disappears so that I know what was there and not let it disappear on me. So, yeah. That's what I'm going to have to do. Get this flower right here. We can top this off. And just get through the day. All right? It's 5 o'clock already. Stock is holding. They're not, like, they're not tearing it up. I can definitely keep up with uh, what's going on. I just have to pay attention. All right. I do want to get uh, that storage space. So I, what do you think we need? What, about 2000 before we pull the trigger on an, on a on a thousand dollar purchase oh, let's turn our lights on all right our bread that's looking good we still have do we have any more peanut butter over here no how's the cereal the bread's about to go let's go ahead and grab some peanut butter and some bread yeah I definitely want to get the stock opened up and see what that's like see how that uh, affects how we're doing this Top this off. All right, what do we got here? More bread. All right, takes care of that. What else do I have? I have my peanut butter. You guys are loving the peanut butter. I think I doubled up on that, right? Yeah, I did. Well, that's a good thing I did double up on that peanut butter, right? All right, how are we doing here? Eggs, milk, cheese is still there. Water's getting low. What time is it? Eight. Go ahead and get a cheese and water. The cheese. Get a water. Purchase that. Grab this water. And yeah, I'm going to save that other space for milk. I'll grab that cheese real quick. And it's nine o'clock. Okay. I think we made it. I think we made it. And by making it, I mean we made it through the day uh, without anybody. Uh, not finding what they were looking for. Now, it looks like they did fix the bug where people were coming in and kind of looking at the shelf and shaking their head and leaving, even though you had everything that your licenses allowed you to have. Uh, so that was a comment. Ooh, I'm getting low on the green oil there, but it doesn't matter. It cannot do anything at this point. I don't have any of that, right? I do have sugar. How are we doing on sugar? Let's go ahead and top off the sugar. Yep, so for right now until we get other employees, I'm the stock boy and I've got to get I've got to get this down. Now what did I have right here? Oh, flour. Flour. Let's go ahead and fill that there that way we're reminded that that's what goes in there. All right, we're getting close to 2000. Not bad. Not bad. I think I'm going to go ahead and pull the trigger on the uh on the storage, guys. I want us to see what that's all about. So uh, in this episode, we took a look at the loans. Uh, we took a look to see if I could keep up with the business, which I did. Let's go ahead and hit enter. All right. I had a good day today. All right. No pro uh, products not found. We had no strikes against us. Uh, and we made a, a nice little profit, a total profit of $509. That's not too bad. All right. We got some good points. Let's go ahead and start the next day. And uh, before we call it, Let's go over here because I believe I'll be able to regen the money. Oh, remember what we have to do at the start of every day. There goes $57. Bills, let's go ahead, pay that, pay that. All right, we're still at $700. I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to do it. 
I'm going to go ahead and check out what the uh, storage is. We're going to purchase storage. All right, the storage is next to your store. We have $727 left, but we have lots of product that we've already invested in. Our shelves are not totally empty. Now, what does it mean it's next to our store? It's right here. All right. So now what does this mean? Does, let's do this. Let's do this. I'm not sure. <laughs> Did we just spend $1,000 to have an extra space to just put stuff? Is that what's going on here? Let me see. I think that's what this is, guys. I think it's just... I think it's just a place to put our boxes now. And I'm also wondering if it... If we order something... Before we close out the episode, let's... Do I need rice? Can I put this rice up here? I can. Before we close out this episode, let's find out something here. All right, so we've got a storage and... You know, so far it looks like just a place to put stuff. But is it, does it work like this? If I buy, I need eggs. Let me buy eggs. Let me buy two eggs. Let me buy a couple of milk. Uh, let me buy a couple of this olive oil. And pasta spaghetti went down in price. I'll have to make the price adjustments before the next episode. But let me just buy these. Purchase them. Did that go into the storage? No. All right, so these items didn't even, like, show up in this storage. So... Uh, it's beyond me what storage means right now, everybody. So we'll try to figure that out. We have storage. All right. So thank you so much, everybody, for joining me and hanging out with me. And if you did like this episode, please don't forget to hit that like button. Drop a few comments. Let me know what you think. And remember, this is an early access game. We're playing it. We're checking it out. We're seeing what it is as it is and what they're going to be doing with it. So again, everybody, I do appreciate the love and support that I get from you all. You guys are fantastic, and I will catch you in the next episode. Ta-ta, and bye-bye.